Restate in Sicily welcomes you to Bisaquino, one of the most interesting towns in Sicily. And a few words to explain you why. First of all, it's uh, midway between the province of uh, Palermo, the towns of Palermo and Agrigento. In fact, it is 75 uh, kilometers from Agrigento, 75 from um, Palermo, 35 kilometers far from the seaside, so it's not uh, difficult to reach the first beach available. It's uh, 700 meters uh, on the sea level, and this is the birthplace of one of the greatest directors in the world of all times, uh, Mr. Frank Capra, who was born here last century. Well, we are in the main square here, and we're admiring all the monuments and the architecture of this beautiful town. And from this place, we can also admire this cathedral, which is wonderful, with all those decorations and statues on the top, and the landscape, which is huge, fantastic. But on my back, we are admiring one of the most prestigious properties here in Bisequino. Interesting price once again. We are going to see it inside in order to propose to you as a perfect purchase, as a perfect deal for your stay in Sicily. You see now, I'm uh, always in the main square this is a cathedral behind me and uh, I'm approaching this uh, wonderful property which is, was built in, uh, at the beginning of the 19th century. Look at the architecture, how nice it is and let's visit it inside in order to get the best of it. One of the things I love of these villages in Sicily is the fact that the hair is fresh and uh, all the, the architecture stays as it was once. Look, for example, at the entrance, it's in this uh, alley, which is wonderful because as you see, all the walls are made of stones. So this is very nice. This is a feature not to forget once you want to buy in Sicily. And let's get inside, as I told you, to get the best of this property to see how wonderful, stable, steady the walls are and uh, all the stuff inside, as you see the landscape, is here in Bisequino, 700 meters on the sea level, but only 35 kilometers from the sea. It's nice to chat, to talk, but let's visit this property. It is on uh, three levels. The first one that we're going to see now is the basement over here. Then we will visit a first and a second floor. Okay, the basement here uh, needs to be restored, but it's nice, comfortable. So you see, for example, the architecture, how good it is made, uh, how, how much room there is here. Uh, Try to think Sicilian once. That's maybe the best way to do when you want to purchase in Sicily. Um, olive oil is a local um, thing here, which is very rich. Uh, here you can have a storage for your olive oil, for your fresh cheese. Sicilian cheese is wonderful. Ricotta cheese or all the stuff like that. Your salami, for example, hanging from the roof, which is wonderful. So think about that as a storage room or as uh, something you may use, for example, to have your lunch or dinner if you restore it properly. Well, let's uh, go from the staircase to the first and then finally to the second floor. Let's see how much it needs to be restored and please uh, think uh, um, uh, in the future with your own eyes about uh, how beautiful this property once it's finished could be. Let's see for example uh, how big it is right now. Look at that. Okay. Very, very uh, good. Oh, wonderful. Look at this. The arch, for example, here. This is a perfect bedroom. Uh, and a bedroom which is much more, it has maybe much more value. Uh, it's more valuable because of this one, which is just, uh, how could you define it? A yard, 
uh, um, a terrace. Well, it's not a terrace because actually you cannot um, see from here, but uh, it's nice because it's a source of light here in Sicily, which is wonderful. And uh, once again, think when it's restored how beautiful it uh, could be. Well, let's continue uh, exploring this property in other bedrooms uh, and other rooms anyway. Okay, this is the bedroom I showed you and uh, all the other small rooms which are uh, wonderful. This is a, um, a bathroom and there's a small room over here we could, which could be, for example, a perfect wardrobe. Okay, looking from here and from the other side, that one here, which could be a very a perfect wardrobe for you, for your usage, for example, when you sleep over here. Amazing, amazing the architecturing that Sicilians used to have once. So it's better maybe to buy an old property like this and to restore it. A renovation could uh, give you back uh, the richness of this house. Okay, let's continue. This is a, a studio over here. And from the studio, uh, everything begins. As you see, it's very wide. And uh, why width means also have uh, light, uh, space for everything. From the studio, uh, we've got another uh, staircase going to the upper levels. And oh, amazing here because uh, there are frescoes on the, uh, on the roof. Amazing. The vault over there. Wow, wonderful. Yeah. Think about that. We are only on the first level. We've got one more to see. And look at the frescoes. Amazing. The frescoes on the roof. The ceiling is wonderful. Everything is hand painted, which is nice. So you may also have uh, uh, an artwork buying this house uh, right now. Um, I, I give you an, an advice, which is important. Uh, this piece of advice is that all the furniture is not included. Uh, we need to be transparent every time we um, show you a property to buy. But actually, as it is right now, it is worth to be bought. Look at that, for example. There are no frescoes here, uh, but, wow, wonderful floor, which is an original Sicilian floor. All tiles are handmade and hand painted once again. And the vault here on the ceiling again. So, actually, it is worth to be bought. It is worth to be purchased, to be restored. Restoration in Sicily is not expensive using local workers. I always insist on that. You know why? Because there are professional people, craftsmen, working for that, and the prices are very, very inexpensive which is nice. We've got two balconies here. One you're seeing now, the other one is over there. You may enjoy the view of the main square. You live in the heart of the town, which is uh, amazing. But let's go outside. As you see, everything uh, perfectly works here. Okay. Oh, look at the light, which uh, all the stuff gives you back, which is Nice and wonderful. And I'm doing that, as you see, without editing. Oh, so everything is real now. You enjoy, I tell you once again, that wonderful cathedral and all the magnificent view of the mountain up there. Because you are, I repeat once again, 700 meters on the sea level, but only 35 kilometers uh, from the seaside, 75 kilometers from Palermo, 75 kilometers from Agrigento. Let's go to the upper level and um, we finally see the, the part of the house which remains, which is uh, as beautiful as the one we uh, are showing now with an interesting price, very low, very good to be restored, but actually restoration is nothing to be afraid of.
In order to, to go upstairs, actually, there's another staircase, which is not the main one that we climbed uh, one minute ago, uh, some minutes ago, better to say. Let's go upstairs and uh, let's see how wonderful this upper and second level is. Wow. There's the kitchen over here. You know, uh, according to the old architecturing, the kitchen was only and always on the upper level. And you know why? Because with the heat of the, of the cookers, you could uh, uh, make all the house warm. So the kitchen over here, uh, this is a, a good dining room with uh, a balcony uh, going to the yard, which I showed you before. A uh, toilet, which is nice because it's a service toilet, and another bedroom over there, which is very, very interesting again. So, I repeat, again, Bisaquino, we are uh, more than uh, 150 square meters. Um, Bisaquino is uh, midway between the towns, the, the cities of Agrigento and Palermo, 75, 75 kilometers, so uh, approximately 50 miles each. Um, 700 meters on the sea level, but only 35 uh, kilometers from the seaside. Wonderful property, three levels, uh, a basement, um, first level, and uh, a second level. And here is the opening of uh, the second level, which is over here. Look at that uh, once again. But look, well, I want to show you something which is which I always insist on when I show you the, the, the houses in Sicily, the steady walls and so, so thick. Look at that. This one here is the frame of the door, a wood door, of course, because everything is in board here in this kind of properties. Look at that. This is the thickness that you've got. It means that the walls are that thick. That thick means having them steady, stable, very, very hard. And this is another bedroom for you. So interesting price, uh, good measure. Um, needs to be restored, but actually it's not uh, an important restoration. You can also uh, be the, 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 the plumbing and the, and the wiring, for example, so electricity and water. Uh, well, as much as you do, as much as uh, the value increases for a house like this, a property which is uh, uh, prestigious, which is in three levels, as I told you, which is uh, um, in front of the main square of Bisaquino, an old interesting town, the one where uh, Mr. Frank Capra, one of the most interesting um, director, uh, was born. Oh, there's the terrace over there. I didn't know that. That's a surprise for me as well. Let's go and see how you, we can find the sun. Oh, because it's easily. It's always funny. Nice. Very, very nice. And you may use this passage as a storage as well, as I told you. Look at that. Look at the tiles, for example. Oh, good. Very good. All the, the tiles of the town, the view, which is magnificent, if you like it. It could be impressive, really impressive. Look at the mountain over there. So this is Bezaquino. This is the first property in Bezaquino. Three levels. It's interesting price, interesting uh, investment. Good to be purchased. Good to be restored. Uh, once again, another treasure, another jewel by Restate in Sicily.